After excessive vomiting subsequent to alcohol consumption, a patient presents with chest pain. You feel crepitus on palpating their chest. What is the most likely diagnosis? The correct answer is Boerhaave syndrome. In Boerhaave syndrome, there is a rupture of the esophagus. Since there is a complete tear in all the layers, air can easily escape from the esophagus into the chest cavity. This explains the crepitus, also known as subcutaneous emphysema. These patients are also likely to have pleural effusion. Endoscopy, vomiting and prolonged retching are risk factors. Consumption of alcohol and vomiting may also make you think of Mallory Weiss syndrome. What makes this condition different is that there are longitudinal tears in the esophagus which are limited to the submucosal layer. Since the other layers are intact, the esophageal contents will not leak out into the chest cavity. Hence, crepitus will not be present. Instead, patients will present with hematemesis, epigastric or back pain. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also take a look at the previous case and let me know if you got the diagnosis right. And if you want to solve more questions on this particular topic, take a look at this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.